With the sole mission to make you smile, Guy Gilchrist has been the artist behind the comic strip Nancy since 1995. Join me as we visit Guy in his studio on this week's Arts Break. I'm one of these old guys that still does everything out of an inkwell. Nancy's been around since 1933. It was created by Ernie Bushmiller. I got a phone call saying that the person that had been working on it for the 10 years since Ernie Bushmiller had passed away was leaving and was I interested in taking it over. And me being so brilliant said, no. I hung up the phone with my agent then I sat down and tried to draw Nancy. Now, I had drawn pretty much every famous character, the Muppets, Looney Tunes, Pink Panther, Tom and Jerry. I could not draw Nancy. I could not draw Sluggo. So I got upset and I got frustrated and I started drawing them without saying anything to anyone. And then I finally picked up the phone after I had six of the daily comic strips all written, drawn, inked, and everything. He goes, hey, nice work, genius. They found somebody. I said, oh, well, you know, what are you going to do? And he said, well, do me a favor. Send me in the strips just in case. So I sent him in about an hour after he got him. He said, well, I don't know who the other guy was, but you're definitely not on the top of his hit parade. You just got the job. See, Ernie, when he created her, he really thought it out. You see, the nose is the simplest you can have a nose. The mouth is the simplest you can have a mouth. The eyes, the eyebrows, it's the simplest you can have anything. Nancy is so simple. If you start really sort of dissecting it, you'll find this simplicity. If you read the strip long enough, you'll see what I mean. They don't do anything that costs any money. The biggest thing they'll do is maybe go to the carnival or the fair, get a slice of pizza or an ice cream cone or one piece of candy. And they're the same happy things that you did when you were a child. It's all very timeless. And that's on purpose. This year marks the 80th anniversary of Nancy. And uh, she's actually having a party. All of her friends from the last 80 years will be there and Nancy will be going like this which is her normal reaction to pretty much everything. You know, she's really been a joy to work on for 18 years, and I hope that I get an opportunity to work on her for the rest of my life. For more information about Guy Gilchrist and his work, visit us online at wnpt.org slash arts. This NPT Arts Break is made possible by the generous support of the Ingram Charitable Fund, and a grant from Tennessee Arts Commission.